everybody. We're heading to the first open house of the day. We're all glammed up, ready to go. Listening to Britney Spears getting pumped up. <laughs> All right, oh, see the Wallington twins, Dustin Davis it. here today with Team Michelle Yu. We got an open house. Davis, where are we? Tell us a bit about this place. Well, first off, look at this beautiful bed. Um, so we're at 8560 General Curry in Richmond. This is a two bed, two bath, uh, super great apartment here. So um, all the logistics are online as well. I'm not gonna bore you guys with all that, but we're gonna take another look inside and just keep walking around here. Sounds good, let's do it. Right when you walk into this beautiful building, look at this foyer. Just hang down here. Kept in immaculate condition. Absolutely beautiful. Let's go take a look at the pool. They have a pool? Oh yeah. Your pool to the left. Look at that. Look at the sunlight coming through. Imagine waking up to that every day. Beautiful. Yeah, as you can see. Super Whoa. high ceilings, can't even touch it. Crazy. It's not the highest vertical. Awesome. <laughs> Good evening, YouTube world. What's We've got the Wallington that? twins here. We just wanted to say a quick hello and one question that has started to come up a lot is, yeah. so why are you guys actually making these videos? Yeah, so that's that's something we were just talking about, and um, it's super important to showcase people, showcase you guys and anyone watching who we actually are in our day to day. Uh, constantly on social media, we're seeing people do perfect photos with filters on, and you you really don't know who they are because you don't see their good, you don't see their bad, you don't see their are they bubbly, are they fun, do they love talking about sales like we do, do they read books like we do, fitness, whatever. And uh, by doing this, you guys are able to see who we are. You know, no phoniness behind anything it's just exactly what you guys act exactly what you see so yeah. we are yeah exactly so i mean it's not going to be always polished and it's not going to be perfect but i mean that's the way we want it we want you guys to see who we really are yeah. um so yeah you guys are going to see more of that and we will talk soon All right, so as we're in the elevator, where are we going right now? So right now we're headed to unit uh, 505. We're at 193 Aquarius Moose. A beautiful awesome. little one bedroom condo on the waterfront of Yale Town. Nice. So super, super convenient if you're looking to be in that central location. Nice. So nice water views. Everyone's nice and vibrant in the summertime too, so everyone's really happy. So Good stuff. <laughs> yeah, let's go. So in particular, this is location, location, location. So we're in Yale Town, right along the water. So it's central to everything. Hey guys, so we wanted to have be both in it, right? Obviously. So uh, I wanted to, we have a few minutes before another person comes to view. We thought it'd be a good idea just to chat about what just happened at our last open house. So mm -hmm. um, I was filming, I don't know, I might've gotten on film or not, but uh, Davis actually, I guess you can just tell them what, what yeah, happened from so, the very beginning, what did you see? And yeah, so it was about 10 minutes to closing uh, the open house. So uh, a lesson for everybody, don't close up early. You never know what's gonna happen. Yeah. Um, anyways, so the customer came or the, the potential buyer came in and then, um, he, I let him know right away. It was a the building you had to be of a certain age to buy there. Did he call you? To and or did you no, no. So him? he was a uh, he was he just was walking by and he just right. noticed I was there. And then so right away I advised I told him that it was the age restriction building. You had to be a certain age to live there or to buy. And he uh, right away I was like, but you know what? Just come take a look, anyways. You never know. I'll give you a good idea of what it looks like. And then if you're looking for anything in the area as well, similar square footage, whatever. Just just trying to build rapport because you never know what can come from it. So he. He came up, uh, showed him around, and then we started just 
Yeah, I was just asking questions, how long he's been looking for, what brought him to that area. Also known as building rapport, qualifying, which all good salespeople should be doing. Yeah, exactly. And then, yeah, we, so we ended up speaking for about 10 minutes and then I got his contact and then I got a really good lead there. And then, so we're going to be speaking tomorrow. He's going to fill me in uh, again on what he's looking for. And I already have a few ideas of what I want to bring him to. Super important, open-ended questions, just trying to figure out who they are. But yeah, it's nice that we had something to sort of have that common ground on and right away where we had we had that that comfortable setting where he knew I wasn't really just trying to sell right. to him. And it only anymore. happened because you yeah. took that initiative to go talk but to him. Anyways, him. that was just a little update and we'll keep going here. Thanks, guys. So cardio section here. All the light drop, but that's all the strength section. So a nice big area that overlooks the pool. Absolutely sweet. <laughs> Water roller. And then uh, change rooms. Nice. It's pretty awesome. So we just finished up at Dustin's showing. Open house. Open house. And yeah, overall, super jam-packed day of which we, we wouldn't have it any other way. It was yep. a good day. Lots of new contacts made and we're gonna get both our properties sold. Absolutely, we sure are. So we just wanted to wrap up this fourth video. Uh, again, any questions, anything that you guys have in mind, leave comments or you can dm us on any of our social media platforms um thank you very much and we will talk to you guys soon